production control is a device to attain the highest efficiency in production which is done by producing the required quantity of production of the required quality at the required time by the best and the cheapest method available in the market. This involves control on production quantity, material, tools, sphere and maintenance as well as controlling the labor efficiency, delivery schedule and many more. A production activity of an enterprise is said to be in control when the actual performance is within the objective of planned performance. Some of the sub-functions of production control as we discussed earlier are dispatching, follow-up and evaluation. So let's see them one by one. First is dispatching. Dispatching is putting the plan into effect by authorized release of resources to plant locations along with the necessary instructions to commence the production in accordance with the requirement of root sheets and schedule charts that we have prepared during production planning. This task is eventually performed by a person called the dispatcher. Dispatching can be centralized by the central office or decentralized. Quantity of production is controlled during dispatching the manufacturing order. The enterprise or the industry is required to exercise effective control over its inventory, which is both material and tools, to prevent overstock and out of stock conditions. Immediate replacement of obsolete and breakdown part is very essential and very mandatory to continue production. However, machine efficiency is significantly affected by the system of periodic maintenance of plant and machinery as well as the user. Then we have follow up. See every production program involves determination of the progress of work and ensuring that the production operation are taking place in accordance with the plan. This process is called follow up. Follow up is basically comparing the actual performance to the planned performance in order to identify the discrepancies in the production for appropriate corrective actions. And last but not the least, we have evolution. See, deviation of actual performance from planned schedule is an unusual phenomenon, it's an anomaly. This can result from breakdown of machines, unavailability of raw material, poor performance of workmen and many more reasons and even management also consider. A break at any point in the supply chain hampers the complete series of operations. Therefore, a periodic evolution is essential to formulate corrective action in order to bring the operation back on the schedule. The most important factor that affects production control are the strikes by the labors. That's why management has to be very, very much connected and humble towards the labor union. Otherwise, the strikes will impart the unprecedented downtime to the industry. 